Today we'll be reading chapters 7 and 8 from Mercy Watson to the Rescue. We left off after our readings yesterday with Mercy looking in at Eugenia and Baby, the next door neighbors, the Lincoln sisters, and Mercy had really scared Baby, so Eugenia had called the uh, fire department to say she needed help, and it ended up being Mercy. So we are about to find out a little bit more about what happens next. Chapter 7. Eugenia ran toward Mercy. Mercy's heart beat faster. There was going to be a chase. Mercy loved a chase. She let Eugenia get very close to her. Oink, said Mercy, dashing away. Get out of my yard, shouted Eugenia. Oink, oink, said Mercy. She ran in circles. She kicked up her heels. No pigs allowed, Eugenia shouted. Oh, sister, said Baby, please be careful. A siren wailed. A fire truck pulled into the Lincoln sisters' driveway. Ned and Lorenzo got out of the truck. Do you think that's the emergency, Ned asked? Could be, said Lorenzo. Ned and Lorenzo sighed. You never know with this job, said Lorenzo. You're right, said Ned. You never know. Chapter 8. Ma'am, said Lorenzo to Baby, did you call the fire department? Oh, dear, said Baby, I did not, but Eugenia may have, Eugenia may have called. Who is Eugenia? asked Ned. My sister, said Baby. Is that her? asked Lorenzo, the one chasing the pig. Yes, said Baby, that's her. Baby and Ned and Lorenzo watched Eugenia chasing Mercy through the yard. Lorenzo cleared his throat. What was the emergency exactly, asked Ned. I thought I saw a monster at my bedroom window, said Baby, but it was not a monster. It was Mercy. Mercy, said Lorenzo. The pig, said Baby, the pig who lives next door. I see, said Ned. Eugenia does not care for Mercy, said Baby. In her opinion, pigs belong on farms. There's something to be said for that opinion, said Lorenzo. Ned nodded. Help, shouted a faraway voice. Help, help, help us. Did you hear that, asked Ned. Somebody is in trouble, said Lorenzo. Let's go. All right, so that is the end of chapter seven and eight. We did get some new characters in this chapter. Okay, so we have, of course, Mercy, Baby, Eugenia, and then, of course, we still have Mr. and Mrs. Watson, who are next door stuck in their bed. But now we also have the firemen, who are Ned and Lorenzo. Our settings are still the same. We still have uh, just two settings. The Watson's house. and the Lincoln's house. And our problem is still not solved. Our problem is that the Watsons are stuck in their bed at their house, but the firemen did just hear them yelling for help. So I'm thinking maybe very soon we will have a solution to our problem. So for now, you're going to go answer questions on chapter 7 and 8, and hopefully we will find out more tomorrow.